Hi friends, welcome to one minute classroom from biologyexamsforyou.com. This is a humble attempt to differentiate three confusing terms in plant tissue culture. Differentiation, de-differentiation and re-differentiation within a minute. Let's begin. So this carrot is a differentiated plant. It is having leaves, roots and stem. In tissue culture, any part of the plant that is used for in vitro culture is called as explant. It can be leaf, it can be even protoplast without cell wall, nodal segments, roots or internodal region, etc. So I have taken the leaf as explant. I have cultured that in this medium. So differentiated explant is taken. After a week or two, I will be getting this callus. Callus is undifferentiated actively dividing meristematic cells that is formed in plant tissue culture. So the formation of undifferentiated callus from differentiated explant is called as de-differentiation. It's very easy to remember. This word promote means moving up. We'll be getting a promotion means moving up the ladder getting a better job with better salary. Whereas demote means moving back. Here what has happened is the differentiated explant become undifferentiated callus moving back to the state of undifferentiation. Therefore, it is called as de-differentiation. We have added DE to indicate moving back. Now the second part is from the callus later we will be getting a differentiated plant like this with leaves, roots and stem. This process is called as redifferentiation. So from the callus, we are getting a differentiated plant later. That is why it is called as redifferentiation. Once again, differentiated to a complete plant. That is why we have added re, R E. In short, the formation of undifferentiated callus from differentiated explant is called as dedifferentiation whereas the formation of differentiated plant from undifferentiated callus is called as redifferentiation. Hope you are clear. Thank you so much for your support. You are with biologyexamsforyou.com. Please subscribe, share and like this video.